let's say you have a bunch of numbers you want to add. Uh, so you can simply use the formula uh, that's equals to sum and then just click and drag these uh, things right here. So it's equal to sum right here, open a bracket and click and drag just like this and close the uh, bracket over here. So you get the sum of numbers. But there, there is an easier way to do this. So you can simply select all of these and then simply go over here and press auto sum. So that will bring up the sum over here at the bottom row right here. So you can also optionally select all the five rows and then press auto sum and you get the uh, formula right here. Uh, optionally, you can also press all equals and that will bring the sum, uh, sum on the bottom row as well. If you want to sum up the right row, you can simply click and uh, drag uh, right across and then click auto sum and you get the sum value right here. So you can uh, go over here, drag the value, press auto sum, go over here, drag the value and press auto sum. And there you go, you get the sum value just like this as you can see right here. So what if you want an average over here? Let's say I want an average value over here. So I'm, I can simply remove this out and I can select all of these right here, go to auto sum and click on address just like this. So it brings an address of 34 as you can see. So if I were to press 35 right here, something like that, you guess, uh, you see that there's the average value right here. If you want the max value, yeah, you do simply just like this, uh, just drag it out, go to order some arrow right here and press max. So that brings the maximum value that is 35 and you can also go for minimum value that is 34. So it actually comes across the other value as, can, as you can see right here. So you can bring up the maximum and the minimum value from the auto sum just like this. You can also count the numbers over here. So you can go over here, count the numbers. So you can see that there are four values. So there are four right here. So you can simply select all of these, go to auto sum, count the values and there you go, that's the six. So that is how you can use sum and average and some other formulas, uh, auto formulas inside of Microsoft Excel. Hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.